Welcome to CSE. In this video, Alex will be showing how muscle oxygen saturation, or SMO2, behaves while riding his mountain bike on the climb. For this video, we used a human hex SMO2 sensor and a Garmin Edge to record the data. The middle screen of the Garmin, that's my uh, muscle oxygen saturation. It's a percentage. As I uh, apply more watts or, or more pressure, then the more oxygen I, I will be consuming will go up and down accordingly. Now, uh, when it turns red, it actually means that I'm on a, on a trend down. I'm actually consuming uh, more oxygen than, than is being supplied. Blue means that I'm, I'm getting a surplus of oxygen. It means that I'm actually resting. When we're looking uh, at the numbers that uh, SMO2 sensor provides, it's not an absolute number, but it's actually just a percentage of uh, utilization versus delivery. So it tells me how much I'm using versus how much is being delivered. So now we can see the my SMO2 is a 54.2. Uh, the, the color is green. I'm gonna start getting to a, uh, I'm, I'm currently climb, I'm climbing, but I, it's, it's not that steep. So I'm gonna get to a, a steeper areas like this, starting to get steeper. So my, my muscles are starting to consume more, more oxygen. So my SMO2 uh, percentage is going down. So now, here I'm, I'm really getting to the, some of the steep parts. And my SMO2 is gonna still go down lower. So I started the climb on the 50s. I'm currently on the 40s. Uh, the green screen means that my body has responded and actually it's increased the blood flow. Right now, I'm not pedaling, so I'm getting a surplus of oxygen. So this next one is uh, technical and it's steep, so we'll see what happens to my SMO2. Okay, almost to the top of this now. Okay, so now we're gonna go up this real steep technical short climb. And uh, let's see, I'm at uh, 47.5. Let's see what happens to my SMO2 on this. Okay, see here. Okay, so it's down to 44.1. But my heart rate hasn't had enough time to increase. And that's something that you will see with uh, muscle oxygen saturation is that it's pretty much instant. Uh, you basically tension your leg and you can see a change. So now that we're out, we can see it going back up and it's, it's blue. Human is doing it. They're not really doing it uh, as a zone, you know, like with a heart rate, you will do a uh, few zones with power as well. With uh, with them, what they're doing, and I think it's it's, it's, it's very good. Uh, the the actual number, surge percentage, and the colors really shows what's happening, but at a faster rate. So basically, right now, it just went red, means that there was 
and in a good increase on consumption. So that's what the red will mean. And then right now, it went blue, and that means that my body uh, increasing the, the supply to the working muscles. Now I'm on green, which means that my body supplying and consuming in unison, which means that, that I'm at a steady state and uh, I should be able to maintain this for, for long periods. I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more cycling science videos.